Being a DA requires honesty and integrity. Do you believe you possess these virtues given recent events involving the campaign signs and use of county resources to campaign? You're on, Mr. Zellerbach. Absolutely. Um, I'm human. I'm not perfect. I made a stupid mistake. Um, it wasn't planned. It was spur of the moment out of a sense of frustration. Um, and I reimbursed the county uh, for the use of the vehicle. That doesn't make it right, certainly. But it's unfortunate that we're even talking about campaign signs. Let's talk about the real issues and the qualifications of Mr. Hessian and myself and our experience and our leadership abilities to run the DA's office and what we've accomplished during the course of our careers. I think that's what's important. Uh, again, I made a mistake. I'll take full responsibility for it. Um, but again, uh, let's look at my 36 years of accomplishments and integrity. Thank you. Mr. Hester. 36 years of experience should have taught Mr. Zellerbach that you cannot bend the rules, you cannot break the law as the chief law enforcement officer. I'm not all that concerned about my signs, to be honest with you. What I'm concerned about is the top law enforcement officer of this county thinking that he's above the law and thinking that he can go and use county resources and county time with a county employee to conduct illegal activity or even campaign activity. And then when you get caught to turn around and say, I'm gonna cut a check, guess what? The defendants we prosecute in court every day, they don't get to cut checks. We prosecute them for crimes because it's the right thing to do. And cutting a check doesn't, that, that doesn't cut it. It doesn't cut it. It's not enough to say you're sorry. matters. In fact, integrity is everything for a district attorney. Everything. Mr. Zellerbach has lost the confidence. We do not believe he possesses the integrity and the honesty to do this job. Would you like to reply, Mr. Zellerbach? Again. I'm sorry. Again. Um, it's unfortunate that uh, we're even talking about signs, and certainly I bear partial responsibility for that. I've accepted responsibility, and uh, I think, again, it's important. My integrity speaks for itself. If you look at my 36 years of service to this county, both as a Superior Court judge and as a prosecutor, um, I, I think it's pretty clear. And certainly those in the community know what my integrity is all about as well.